So, I wanted to practice Python programming with Copilot and Codium AI. The first thing I've done is search for a Python repository that I can play with, and I found this very popular one. Thanks to Codium AI and Copilot, within a few minutes, I managed to generate a few sanity tests, find a few bugs, fix them, add additional regression tests, and then I was ready to add capabilities and features. Let me show you how I've done that. Once Codium AI is installed, above each independent class or function, you should see this Generate Tests button. I'll click it. Now, Codium AI is analyzing my code as well as generating a full test suite for me automatically. Meanwhile, let's review the code. Here we go. First, there is this abstract employee class, and then there are the operator, supervisor, and director classes that inherit from the employee. There are also the call state class, the call class, and the main call center class. The code analysis is ready, but I'm waiting for the test plan. The test plan includes six test cases that were selected for my initial test suite. There are many more test cases that I can choose from. I'll go over it later on. There's also an option to add my own test case. I can add in natural language description a test case, and then Codium AI will generate the test code for me. Okay, the test code is ready. I'll choose this one. I simply want to, I want to run some sanity checks. Let's save the file, test, call, center, initial one. from call center, call center. Let's also call operator, thanks copilot. Now let's try to run it. And we have a problem. Okay, seems that it will be better to call the operator and then the supervisor and then the director. And this gives me a hint that it will be better to add some type hinting here. List of operator and list of supervisor and list of director and typing. Okay, I can run this test, but I will simply call Codium again, Codium again, because I added a type hinting that could really help. Okay, now Codium is analyzing the code again and will generate a test plan for me. This time, I am going to choose the test case that I want. Okay. Uh, valid rank, complete is cool, looks cool. Notify, call complete. Uh, anything else with no available employee? Let's see if it's something interesting. Okay. No employee is assigned. Ah, that seems cool. Okay. Okay, and this is actually a, a TDD case for a function that I didn't implement yet, but I don't want it right now. And I want to say, have um, operator, supervisor, and director all being assigned with calls. Let's regenerate. I already see that the setup method is much better thanks to the type ending. Let's wait for the test code. Okay, this time I'll choose all. No. Save. Test, call, center, cool. Thanks. From call center, here we go, text, thanks, go palette. Let's try to run this. And cool. Okay, none is passing. Okay, I see a serious problem here. There is a coupled initialization problem. Employee needs call center and call center needs employee. Not good. Okay, we'll come back here later. Meanwhile, let's do this, this, this. And we wanna have the employee diff set call center things. Now we can and if add employee, thank you, with the set call center. So we can do for operator, hmm, actually for employee. And yep, like this. This is great, let's try to run. Okay, still not passing, let's see what's happening. Okay, hmm, 
There's another issue. There's another bug, supervisor and director super init correctly. Let's try again. Nice, three out of four pass. I can come and check what's happening here later. So like you saw, with Coding AI, I can generate tests and create them as a TDD style if I implemented just a header, or I can add some regression if I already implemented the code, while it's also challenging me on some of the stuff that I've, I've done. And Copilot can help me to add a few lines of code as I go. Uh, thank you for, for so much for watching this, and I hope you will enjoy using these two tools.